by David Patton, who is Professor of Industrial Economics at Nottingham University and member of Economists for Free Trade. I know we were trying to talk to you earlier, David, and had a few problems, so thanks for your patience. Um, I just want to explore this idea of a no-deal uh, Brexit and if then the UK was trading under World Trade Organization uh, terms, uh, do you accept that that would incur substantial costs? Uh, not related to the situation at the moment. Let's remember that trade is not free with the European Union at the moment. We pay a fee of £14 billion to £9 billion net for the right to trade freely with the European Union. That's a huge amount of money. Now, actually, there's no need, need for us to be paying money for a mutually beneficial deal and Canada trade freely with the European Union without paying that fee. So leaving the European Union gives us the option of exploring uh, free trade with the EU and other countries without paying that money. And of course, if we leave without a formal trade deal, I think we want to strike one in the future, and the idea that it will take two years or more to strike one the EU is, I'm afraid, nonsense. Uh, we start from a position where our standards are exactly the same. Uh, and what we should be looking for now um, is a deal similar to that with Canada, where we trade without tariffs, is what the EU has indicated they would like, and it's clearly in our interest too. But of course, leaving without the deal has other advantages. We save the money on the divorce bill, which we wouldn't have to pay. We would get the benefits of Brexit, Brexit much earlier without the transition deal. And that's what I think what doesn't get talked about enough. There are significant benefits from us leaving the European Union in that we will be out of this tariff war, this protectionist war, which the EU sets to countries outside the EU, and which forces prices up to UK consumers. But our economy, or do you accept that our economy, has been constructed over decades uh, as because we are part of the single market, and that any change to that is surely going to have a knock-on effect on businesses and the wider economy? Surely. Well, uh, but of course there'll be effects, but those effects make good and bad. So the problem with the single market is it affects not just those minority firms who export to the European Union, but every firm producing in the United Kingdom. Now some of those rules are good and we want to carry on with them. Some of them are designed really for European Union producers, not for us. For example, the ports directive they want to bring in will be very damaging for our ports. Once we leave the European Union and the single market, we will be able to decide well, which rules work for our businesses, and which don't, and that could give us a significant boost to our economy. What about uh, if Theresa May gets her way and achieves this checkers deal? Would that be the answer and help UK business in the economy? So the checkers deal is really fundamentally flawed, which proposes to keep us within the single market for good. So we don't get those advantages for the European Union. It goes directly against what Theresa May promised we would do um, over the past few years. And well, who knows whether it will come in place, but everyone on, on every side seems to not like this check and steal. There would, there would still be some advantages in that we would be leaving the European Union, uh, we would be outside the customs union, so we wouldn't have to charge those high tariffs on our imported goods for free and clothing, which puts up prices for, for UK consumers. But it's really not what we should be aiming for. We should be looking for a good free trade deal with the European Union, but outside the single market and the customs union. Professor David Patton from Nottingham University, a member of Economists for Free Trade. And um, thanks so much for your time and your patience. Good to talk to you. It's great to not happen, by the way. I'll know for next time. Apologies. Okay. <laughs> thanks. <laughs> After Bye. all that. <laughs> thanks.